We met through a scholarship program that was coordinated through the Office of Minority Student Affairs at UConn. The person who was coordinating the program said, asked to meet Alice Melville because she's also from Southeastern Connecticut. They pointed her out across the room and I thought, wow, she's beautiful and so poised and she's had it all together. I said, I would really like to marry that woman one day. I thought he was very kind, delightful to talk to. I just kind of made a note and said, hmm, I think it might be nice to get to know him better. She was everything that I had hoped for, so it started because of a scholarship. And what attracted me about UConn was there were so many great programs and I fell in love with the people, some of the best friends that I have in life. I met at UConn. I love the campus, I love the setting, I love the rolling hills, and I love the dairy bar. There's just so much to love. What I love about UConn is all the friends that I made here. They are lifelong friends. Everyone is very enthusiastic about their experience here. When we come back on campus and we go to basketball games, it just feels like home. UConn gave me such a great start for my professional career, for my personal life. <laughs> what I took away was priceless. And I want that for every student that steps onto this campus. We were inspired to establish the scholarship because we benefited from a scholarship early on and it was life-changing for us. And the way we envision the scholarship funds being used is multifaceted. One, academic scholarships for students, but also a mentorship program and then perhaps a lecture series. We think of Dr. H. Fred Simons, someone who saw us through graduation, but also was an integral part of our lives. If we can do that through a scholarship, that's something that is very important to us.